Viral Science, the home of creativity. Hey friends, welcome back. In today's video, I will show you how to make clap lights with ATtiny85 microcontroller. So let's get started with this video. For this project, you will require ATtiny85 microcontroller, a socket for 8 pin ATtiny85, then a sound sensor with analog pin, a relay module, and a 10 UF 50 volts capacitor. Now we cannot directly program this ATtiny85 microcontroller, so we will be using Arduino Uno for this. And follow the circuit diagram to connect your ATtiny with Arduino. To make it simpler, I am designing my own PCB to program our ATtiny85 microcontroller. So to order our PCBs, I am visiting jlcpcb.com. So first sign in with your Google ID, then click on code now and add your Gearbird file over here. Link to download this Gerber file is in the description down below. Now after uploading, you can select the quantity and color of your PCB and simply place your order. The quality of this PCBs is extremely good. So now we'll quickly place our components and start soldering this PCB. Now before uploading the program, we will remove this PCB from our Arduino Uno board and directly connect our Arduino Uno with your computer. First we will need to get 80 tiny boards in our Arduino. So visit this link and copy these statements from here. Now open the Arduino IDE. Now go to file and go to preferences. Now paste those lines over here and click on OK. Now here go to boards manager and after scrolling in the bottom you will find the 80 tiny boards. Just click on install. After the installation completes, just close everything and restart your Arduino IDE. Now go to file, go to examples and click on Arduino ISP. Over here, just select the board that is Arduino Uno. Then you can select the port and simply upload the code. Select Arduino as ISP and simply upload the code. After uploading, connect our PCB to Arduino Uno with 80tiny85 on it. Now open our code. You can find this in the description down below. Now select the board that is 80tiny85. Select the frequency, select the port, select Arduino's ISP and burn bootloader. After this finishes, just simply upload the code. And that's it, we have uploaded the code to our ATtiny85.
Now follow the circuit diagram to make our today's project. Now I am tapping over the sound sensor just to produce some sound. As you can see the green light on the relay is turned on. Now we will be using the high voltage current and turn on and off our 220 volt AC bulb. So be very careful while doing this. You can take help of an electrician or any expert. So friends, I hope you like this video, then hit the thumbs up button below, share this video with your friends and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more such videos and I will see you in the next one. Do subscribe and press bell icon to get instant notification for new video.